Now in this video we'll have a look at how you configure the appearance of the app. Um, so we just click on the menu and we click on system settings. Once again, if you don't have access to this, just contact the person who set up the account. Um, under system settings, we click on system appearance. And now we can edit some of these properties. So for example, if we wanted to change the app skin or the color of the app, we just click on edit and we can select a different color. We're going blue is quite, um, so we have a series of predefined palettes. Now this one's quite popular. And that means all of the buttons and everything changes. Um, and it changes on your phone as well. Uh, go back into system appearance, click on edit. You can remove the logo. You can upload it to your own logo or a different logo. Um, color code, actions and tasks. This is quite nice. So um, <clears throat> you might want to uh, ha have a combination of sales tasks, administration tasks, finance tasks, personal work. So what you can do is you can color code. You can tag a color with a name of um, or a type of task or appointment. Uh, all it does is it just helps to organize stuff in your diary um, and also in a project plan. So that's quite nice. If you haven't entered in anything here, it just won't appear uh, when you go to enter in a task, but it will detect if you are if you want to categorize them. Um, same with number and currency formats. Once again, this should all be predefined when you set up your account initially, but if you've made a mistake, then you can go in and change the currency uh, and so on. Same with date and time formats. Um, once again, you can say, is it day first for Europe and so on, or is it month first, for example, for the US market? And very easy to set up and change, just system appearance.